Hello and welcome to day three of week eight of training cycle one of 2021. And of course the math doesn't work because we're on week five right now uh, of 2021 and I'm on week eight of my training. So how does that work? Well, I actually started um, the last few weeks um, last year. So that's why all the numbers and all the weeks are kind of fucked up. I didn't start on New Year's Eve, as a lot of people do. I started before that, because um, nothing magical happens by starting to train on a specific day. The earlier, the better. So I started training, and one and a half weeks in, I'm like, you know what, fuck it. I'm going to start recording my workouts again. YouTube is fun. I love it when people watch my videos. I love it when people like my videos. I love it even more when people comment on my videos, when actual real people give me feedback, speak to me, tell me, hey Ivan, you you should fix your fucking grip, you should do this and that exercise to do so, I love it when people say, I just hit the same deadlift as you, but I'm five kilos lighter than you, and um, even though it might be slightly annoying when you post a big personal record, and people are like, oh I did the same but better, uh, it still motivates me, and sometimes I get a guy on my channel that's super much stronger than me, sometimes I get guys on my channel, I mean, Uh, I think someone who's subscribed to me, or if not subscribed, uh, at least watches regularly and comments regularly, um, it's a man who bench presses, I believe, 110 kilos for 8 reps, which is super impressive. Um, Yeah, so, um, yeah, I I love it. I love the community I'm already creating. Um, Of course, I'm going to have the trolls as well. Um, I had a funny troll who uh, subscribed uh, today. Um... I don't need to mention his name, but I think if he's watching this, he knows who he is. He has a really funny um, icon and really pretty funny and childish name. So um, I'm I'm taking all comers here. I'm taking young guys, old guys, and, um, you know, maybe I'll have some women watch this channel in the future. Um, however, looking at my, st- my analytics right now, uh, according to YouTube, 100% of the people who watch these videos are male, which really... Does that matter? No. Because here's the thing. How many girls do you personally know who are obsessed with strength training? All right, just you can't even count them on one hand. Uh, it's a very rare group of people and those girls are most are more likely to follow girls. So um, I'm not worried about it. I'm not doing this channel to get female attention. I'm doing this channel to help guys and girls get bigger and stronger and better and faster and healthier and more confident, all right? So um, this channel is to help people and to entertain people. Um, that is the goal of this channel. That's why I'm doing it. And I love, I love it. Um, sometimes it is difficult to post videos every day, but more often than not, um, I keep telling myself that, wow, this is so worth it. But if it ever stresses me too much, which it has, uh, some at some point in my life, I had to stop filming because it was just straight up, I had so much to do, so I couldn't keep doing it. But right now, I have the time. Um, school is very difficult, um, but I can take the extra stress, and I wouldn't really call it a stressor as much as a time consumer, but I figured out a good template here. Um, this YouTube channel adds probably 15 to 20 minutes um, per day, extra to my day, um, 15 to 20 minutes is really worth it for me to build a community and to help people and to share my journey and to document my training. It's, it's incredibly worth it at the moment and that's why I'm posting these videos. Now for those of you who stick around, um, who are still listening, thank you and therefore because you're listening I'm going to give you a little sneak peek into the future. So, um, when I hit a 160 kilo deadlift, um, I plan to market this channel more. Um, I'm going to start using hashtags and keywords and thinking about um, a little small technical stuff here and there. Um, Working on increasing my subscribers, increasing my outreach, but more importantly, uh, increasing the quality and quantity of, of my content. As of right now, I'm almost exclusively posting my training sessions, which is more so as a documentation more than as a um, entertainment slash informative segment. So what I'll start doing um, fairly shortly, within a couple of weeks, a month or so, 
is I will start posting videos, um, which, you know, they can be about anything. They can be about muscle, fitness, strength, health, um, I don't know, um, bone density, diet, uh, cardiovascular training, um, running and knee pain, like all those stuff, those things that I'm interested in, in, you know, um, stretching for athletes, like anything that people are interested in, I'm going to start posting, uh, fitness videos about that fairly soon. And another thing I'm going to do, which this is super interesting, I think, and I think you guys will like it is once I get enough subscribers, once I get enough people watching my videos regularly, I can start making Q&As. Um, right now, I don't want to make a QA. and a I have made Q&As in the past. The issue with a QA and a is right now, I don't have enough people that watch my videos and that comment uh, regularly um, for me to be able to ask um, four questions in the comments and then take them up in a video. Basically, what I'm saying is um, I need a slight volume of questions to do Q&As, say every week, every month, whatever it may be. And uh, right now, I don't have enough people um to make that happen, but I will do shortly, and um, I love you guys, thank you for watching this, um, and you go on and have a great day.